There are three types of data sets used for discovering the best model. The training set, the validation set, and the test set. What is the difference? Why do we use three different data sets? The training set is the data you use to actually train or condition your model on. So if you were using a neural network, you would use the training set to adjust the weights of the neural network. The validation set is the set you use to pick the best parameters or the best model to use. For example, if you created 10 different models with different parameters, you compare the results of all your different models and choose the one that works the best on the validation set. The test set is only used to get a reading for how accurate your model is. Why can't you use the training or validation set to tell how well your model performs? You can't use the training set to measure performance because your model might have memorized some of the training data, which would mean a higher performance than on real data. You can't use the validation data set to get this reading because you choose a model based on the performance of the validation set, which creates model bias. Basically, you have no idea if the extra performance you achieved from changing your model hyperparameters was because the parameter change was the right move or because that model just happened to perform better on the validation data set. The idea of a test set is to measure how good your model is, and if that performance is way different from your performance on the validation set, you should st just start over from scratch. What's confusing is that in the real world, a lot of tutorials and instructions only refer to the training set and a test set, where the test set acts as both the validation and the testing sets as I defined earlier. That is, a lot of tutorials refer to the test set as both the thing you use to choose the best model and the thing you use to estimate performance on real-world data. While this could be fine, you could run into the issue where performance in the real world doesn't match the performance during testing. <laughs>